So let's say you have a lot of footage and now you have to color grade to color match one video to another, you're in the right place. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Thomas Love here from One Land Solid. And today we're gonna talk about this solution that I found, which is very quick and dirt, because most of the times maybe you have different footage from videos from B-roll and you have to align and color grade and it requires plenty of time. We're talking about hours. Now, I don't know what software you're using in Final Cut or whatever, I'm using DaVinci Resolve. And so I found this solution. The guys reached out to me and proposed to give it a try and I did and I will show you the results because with this retouch for me video retouching plugin for DaVinci Resolve you are able to pick up one video or one photo which you are happy with and it will apply it as a lot to the rest of the footage so for each video you don't have to color grade and then give it the right nuances and then align see that the white balance from one video to the photo to the other one they are all the same because retouch for me will do it for you now i am aware that retouch for me also have many solutions for uh, photo editing i'm not into that because for that i'm using luminar neo Opery. but for video this is a great thing now i will show you with real examples last sunday we had this boat race so i went out and i shot some log footage for you so we're gonna transform starting from the log and i also gave it a try starting from the s cineton to see if they were aligned if we were having the same results so let's say that if you start from log whatever camera you're using sony to canon to nikon uh, even different log v log s log it will have the same effect so you don't need to convert from one log to another or to color match different lots because these retouch for me will do it for you and so let's see together what's happening so right now as you can see i have this log footage it was shot far from distance because i'm using my 55 mil plus the clear zoom so i had more or less an 80 mil but then as you can see it's still to be graded so let's go here in this part when you can actually choose from the effects as you can see there are many options here let's go down to the retouch for me and we apply it to this video here and then it tells you what temperature what tint what percentage but it lets you choose the reference image now i pre-selected this one which i'm happy with because this part was from distance as you can see i have a good dynamic range i have a good saturation in the sky and you can still see uh, the boats and so it's a good one and i want to use that so i will use always the same photo for every video as you can see here you have a preview and now we'll see with the second one we are doing the same thing we are applying retouch for me and we are choosing the same image now as you can see from the first to the second one it applied that photo as a lot so that's no need to color grade anymore because it made it for you so if you want to have a look here we are having exactly the same nuances for the water for the white balance for the sky it's a terrific job and now when it switches to the next video let's say we're here it switches to the next one i still have to Got it as you can see we are having the same lot applied so done less than a minute you have your solution now we try to do it to these other two videos that i shot in s cineton and we're trying to do the same thing so we're applying the retouch for me and we're choosing the same reference image and boom as you can see it's a bit stronger because starting from as cineton when it had already a color base it translated into deeper blues so uh, it might not be working if you're using as cineton i suggest you only use it on your log shots but apart from that i think more or less everybody we are all shooting in log because we want a better dynamic range so this is the solution you are looking for if you have a quick and dirty delivery to be done look no further 
So what do you think? The results were quite good in my humble opinion. I think it's gonna save me a lot of time. Feel free to find the affiliate link down here below. That's a good offer for you if you want to try it out. I don't know if you're using Final Cut, DaVinci or uh, Premiere Pro, you have the version dedicated to each one of those softwares. And please let me know down here in the comments if you're happy with the end results. So with that, I hope you got some value out of this video. If you did, please remember to like it, share it on social media, subscribe to the channel so you won't miss the new videos to come. And I guess I will shoot it. Thank you. Bye-bye.